Hey guys, so today I have a haul for you guys and I am just so excited about everything that I got. You do not even know. Um, I went to Little Five Points, which is downtown in Atlanta and it takes forever to get there, but it's so worth it. It's like... I don't know how to describe it, but if you've ever been there, you know what I'm talking about. Like, it's completely my place to go because there's like spray painted walls and like thrift stores and um, I don't know, just like everything like that. Um, it's like my favorite place ever and it's kind of scary when you go there, okay, but um, we had a good time. So I went with Lindsay and Nevin and it was Lindsay's first time in Little Five, so that was nice. There's a bunch of just random stores there and then um, they have like American Apparel and stuff like that and so I got places from like random thrift stores and um, just really random places and then I got some stuff from American Apparel that I'm going to show you and um, yeah, let's go ahead and get into it. So the first place that we went to was called Crystal Blue, and um, I'm sure none of you have heard of it, but I'm just going to show you what I got there. Um, I got this necklace, and as you guys know from maybe, I like talked about black cord necklaces before, and Little Five is literally where I get all of them, and so um, yeah, I got another one, and this one was $14, which was not too steep, and I got another Aries necklace, and as I was like trying to say before, some of you may know I'm an Aries, I have another Aries black cord necklaces that I love to use, um, or wear, I guess, but I like this one a lot. I don't know. It's different. It's like a stone, and I'm just going to show it to you. It says Zodiac Talisman, and then it has the little thing right there, and, like, it's a black cord chain, and, well, not really a chain. It's just a black cord, and so if you don't know what that looks like, that's what it looks like, um, but, yeah, I don't know. I was in love with this. I like it a lot, so, yeah, a new necklace. Okay, and then next I got a pair of sunglasses, and this is what they look like. They're circle shades, and I love them so much. They're just black, and like, I don't know. I just like them so much. Lindsay bought a pair of these from Urban Outfitters, and I stole them multiple times, and then she was like, literally, Megan, like, I'm going to be so mad at you if you do not buy your own pair. And so then I saw these there, and I was like, okay, I'll buy my own. And I just like how they're like all black, um, because I do like black things. That sounded so weird. Stop. These are the brand Jupiter, and I honestly don't know the store that I got them at. It was like a t-shirt store. It was like a custom t-shirt store, and then they just had sunglasses too. And these were only 15 bucks, so um, I figured why not. <laughs> Sorry, I'm all fidgety today, by the way. I'm just really uncomfortable. Okay, and the next place that I picked things up from was a consignment store called Psycho Sisters, and consignment thrift store, same thing. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna show you what I got. Um, I just like finding like really outrageous things and getting them, and I saw these, and I literally fell in love, and I can't wait to wear them. And it's a pair of overalls, and they look like this and they're red and plaid and I just like how in the back it doesn't like go up all the way like it only covers over your butt and um like the chains go down farther and they have like pockets on the butt and like a pocket in the front and these just remind me of like childhood and I can I don't know. I didn't even try these on. I just bought them, honestly. I just grabbed them <laughs> and I love these a lot and then the next thing that I got um, is this shirt, and it's inspired by, uh, Kate Barker, or was it Shannon? I can't remember. It was one of the Barker sisters, but they, um, one of them, I'm, okay, it was Kate. I'm pretty sure it was Kate. She, um, got, like, just a plain army shirt from, I think it was, like, Walmart or something, and then she distressed it and cut it into a muscle tee, and I am gonna, like, follow that video or whatever she said to make my own. And it's already kind of distressed and, like, worn out, but I liked it a lot because of the pocket that it has on the front. I planned on getting this just so I could um, make it a muscle tee and make it super cute and distressed and whatnot. And so yeah, I picked this up and I am very sorry. When I did that thrift haul like forever ago, I was like, oh yeah, I'm gonna make a video this weekend and show you guys cutting all that stuff up. No, no, I didn't do it because all of that stuff has been sitting in a pile over there waiting for me to cut it up for weeks, but I still haven't done it. So I'm just gonna add this to the pile and make like a whole um, video on like cutting up shirts, um, distressing things, stuff like that. I don't know what I'm gonna do yet, but I'm just gonna show you like some thrifting stuff that I buy to basically ruin or make my own. So yeah, Psycho Sisters, that's a cool place. Okay, and next 
is a place called The Clothing Warehouse and it is classic vintage clothing and I just love every single thing that they have there. I've bought stuff there before like the last time that I went and I bought more this time and it is like okay it's not pricey um I got two pairs of shorts and they were both like 25 bucks which is really good especially for like denim shorts and so I'm going to show you guys them and yeah everything's just kind of in the 20s range really which is kind of annoying but um yeah so I got this pair of cutoffs and they're kind of plain but I don't know they looked really nice on and so they're just like blue denim they're not like distressed or anything they kind of have like um a distressed edge at the bottom but that's it I really just think somebody cut these up and then they sold them <laughs> but um, they're really nice quality like they're not gonna fall apart um, they fit really really nicely on and they're just like a regular pair of cutoffs and I needed a fine pair of cutoffs that actually fit me because my ass is not fitting into any kind of jeans that I have at the moment I just really needed some new ones okay then the next pair of shorts that I got are a pair of white shorts and I've been looking for white shorts for literally forever and so they're high-waisted they're a actual perfect short like I'm not kidding um, the material is not like a jean material it's like a cloth material kind of let's see what it is actually oh they're polyester and cotton that's it they're not jean material but they look like this and then the back looks like this they're not like cheeky or anything like the bottom is just seamed in and they're just nice like they just look nice on but the only thing about these was besides the fact that they make my butt look great um <laughs> they're like see-through and so i guess i'm gonna have to wear either <laughs> commando no panties at all just kidding um a nude like underwear with this because when i was trying these on i was wearing black underwear and let me tell you that did not look good together but i finally have a pair of plain white high-waisted shorts and I love these and they fit so nice on whoo when I put them on this lady um who was like working there she was like wow look at your cute butt and I was like oh, God, I feel so cute <laughs> and then the next thing that I got is maybe a little confusing not really it's a pair of pants and they're like this floral design and as you can see they separate right here but yeah, so I got these, and these are just like so perfect and flawless and looked so amazing on. They fit so well. I just think that they're made really nicely. They have like these buttons on the back to fasten them, and the pattern is super pretty. And yeah, I can wear these like at the beach or really anywhere. And I just love like flowy pants, and you guys know I love like maxi skirts and everything of that sort. So of course I liked these. And the next place that I went to was American Apparel. Yay! I don't know why they gave me this such small bag for everything that I got. But um, I got two pairs of shorts and I'm going to show them to you. So this first pair is just probably the most perfect pair of high-waisted shorts I've ever owned. Um, like I said before, none of my jeans like fit me at all anymore. And the other night I was with my friends Nevin and Kaylee and I was like putting on this pair of shorts and I was just like, what happened? Well, obviously like I gained weight. I mean, like it was because of birth control and everything like that, but all together, my shorts just, I mean, some of them fit, a lot of them do fit, but I didn't have like a really nice pair of high-waisted shorts that I knew would not rip or that I knew would not um, like go bad, go bad, like I'm talking about shorts like they're food. But I just needed a nice quality pair of high-waisted shorts and they look like this. And so they're just like a light wash high-waisted short and they are so freaking cute. They're perfect. They're so well made. If you're going to get these, they are probably the most high-waisted pair of pants I've ever owned. And so um, take notice of that or like take that into consideration. Like they're so high-waisted. Like they come up, literally they show like this much of your stomach like from your boobs. Like they, they come up so high past your belly button, like a good two inches up your belly button. So if you're um, into that, you know, get these. But um, yeah, I love these and they're just so well made and amazing and just, uh. and I'm glad I'm kind of leaving off on this next product right here. Product. Um, well, there went the bag. I don't even know how to describe my love for these shorts. Um, I absolutely love sunflowers. I really like any kind of flower, really. But um, particularly sunflowers, they just bring me happiness. And I just think they're so pretty and sunflower like trends right now are just 
making my life. And so when I saw these, I think I might have started crying. I don't really know. Okay, I'm kidding. Like, I didn't start crying. But when I saw them, I was just like, I'm getting them. Like, I already decided I'm getting them. I love those. I love them so much. And just, I'm going to show them to you because they're the best things to ever happen to me. Look how freaking cute these are. I, like, don't even know what to say, honestly. Um, so, yeah, they they just have sunflowers all over them. And they're just really high-waisted shorts. Kind of like the last ones. Um except they're just in sunflower form and American Apparel probably makes like the best quality stuff ever and so um, these are so well made and they look nice, they don't look like they're gonna fall apart and they don't look cheap, they look amazing and I cannot wait to wear these. And then for my last thing, this was a random um, going off on a limb over here, but I did online shopping. I got this off of Nasty Gal and I was just really feeling down about myself the other day. Just kidding, but I mean I was just having a bad day or something and I was like, you know what? I need to shop. I need to online shop and so I online shopped yay and I found this really cute skirt for $25 in the Nasty Gal section and I'm in love with it. It's a dip dyed high low like how perfect is this? So it completely fades into just all white and um, as I said it's a high-low so it goes down uh, like really low I guess back here and then goes up really high up here. But um, I tried this on already and it fit really well and this being in the Nasty Girl section for $25 like made my life. I was just like heck yeah I am buying that. Um, get that in my cart right now. So I did, and I got it, and it got here within like two days, no lie, so this was very good, and I decided to show it to you. So yeah, um, that was everything that I got. I got a bunch of random crap, but I'm literally so excited about every single thing that I got, and I cannot wait to wear all of it. I mostly got clothes, yeah, besides like that necklace and sunglasses, but um, I hope you guys liked this and liked seeing what I got a little bit. Um, I went a little overboard, but I mean... It was nice. It was like a nice time. I've been trying to like save up to go there because I know how much I love everything in Little Five Points and I just, whew, it was just a exhilarating experience. So if you ever go there, you know, shout out to these stores. Go hit them up. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this video and enjoyed seeing everything that I got and I'll see you in my next one. Bye. <laughs> only other been, I'd only ever other been there that I don't even know what I'm trying to say. The only other time I've been there was one other time, so it was my second, was this um, thrift store and it's called